Hello everyone, this is Dr. Kanchan. I welcome you all in this video. In today's video, we are going to discuss about what is clinical psychology. So this is the first slide. What is clinical psychology? Clinical psychology is a branch of psychology concerned with assessment and treatment of mental illness, abnormal behavior and psychiatric problems. This field integrates the science of psychology with the treatment of complex human problems, making it an exciting career choice for people who are looking to work in a challenging and rewarding field. The branch of psychology which specializes in assessing, diagnosing, treating and preventing mental disorder in human is known as clinical psychology. It studies the emotional and behavioral disorders among the young and adults. So what is the main focus of clinical psychology? Clinical psychology is a broad branch of psychology that focuses on diagnosing and treating mental, emotional and behavioral disorders. Some of the more common disorders that might be treated include learning disability, substance abuse, depression, anxiety and eating disorders. So we can see one name it is written here is Leitner Wittmer. So who was Leitner Wittmer and what is the contribution? So we can see that Leitner Wittmer is generally considered to have founded clinical psychology in 19 sorry in 1896 Mac Reynolds 1987 1997 Ruth 1996 Watson 1956 all uh, they were very much um, included in uh, supporting the clinical psychology and Hippocrates was the ancient Greek founder of medicine always a close professional cousin of clinical psychology and a scientific model for psychology in general what is the difference between clinical psychology and counseling psychology a counseling psychologist has a stronger focus on healthy individuals who have fewer pathological mental pro problems a clinical psychologist has a stronger focus on those with a psychosis or other serious mental illness. Defining the nature and scope of clinical psychology. Clinical psychology is the branch of psychology that focuses on developing assessment strategies and interventions to deal with these painful experiences that touch everyone's life. The development of effective assessment, prevention and intervention services relies on basic research into the nature of emotional distress and well-being. The practice of clinical psychology also covers indirect services that do not involve contact with those suffering from a mental disorder such as consultation activities, research program development, program evaluation, supervision of other mental health professionals and administration of health care services. Thank you so much everyone for watching this video. Namaskar.